I will give some recommendations. The first suggestion is don't postpone. Don't postpone repentance. From Isaiah 48, There is no peace, says the Lord, for the wicked. If you are angry with, angry with someone, go ask for forgiveness from God and this person. Don't postpone it. You will remain upset and have no peace otherwise. Someone may still be upset for days. He should have asked for forgiveness and let his peace return to him. Why do you stay upset or angry with someone for weeks and months? Your loss. Repentance is the first key for peace. When you repent, your thoughts calm down, your conscience calms down, relationships become calm, and peace makes its return. Please don't postpone repentance. Repent first by giving God a word, saying, Forgive me, I'm sorry, I have sinned. And then go, whenever possible, to the priest, but the foundation of repentance is prayer. Also, don't postpone apologizing. A couple may still be angry at each other for a week. Who pays the price? The children. And who is happy about it? The devil. Be sane and apologize to your wife. Be the bigger man and say, I'm sorry. Only the bigger man can say it. He doesn't think about who was to blame. He is bigger, like God. Apologies will make peace return. Don't postpone love. Don't postpone a visit or a call to your old father or someone in pain. Do it to get it over with and your peace will come back. These acts of love may be a call or a message. You are postponing it and losing your peace. 